Welcome back to CAD CAM tutorial. Today we are going to create this simple 3D model with the help of 2D drawing. I hope you like it. So let's see this is the 2D model. Uh, we will create this 3D drawing with the help of this one. So let's start to create this beautiful part in SOLIDWORKS. Now let's go to open file new and choose your part. Okay. Now we are in the SOLIDWORKS interface, so let me add some background white. And this is the our 3D drawing which is going to be created here. First we will create this back flange. This diameter is 98 millimeter and the thickness is 15 millimeter. Then later we will make six holes with 10 millimeter diameter. Now let me choose here front plane, a sketch, circle and let's draw a circle, a smart dimension and define this diameter 98 millimeter. Enter, exit and go to feature and choose here extruded boss base. Now we want to expand this one up to 15 millimeter. See, you can keep blind 15 millimeter or rather keep mid plane. If you keep mid plane, it will move in both direction so blind is enough for us okay now see the edges are not sharp see so what we will do option documents property image quality higher the image okay and here refresh now see image perfect circular now again choose this face a sketch take the normal position let me draw one circle first and this diameter is 70 millimeter according to drawing okay now here we choose this line and select here for construction okay because we want to create hole here let me choose circle and i'll draw one circle at the top and we will define this diameter 10 okay now we need six number of holes so we will use here one command circular sketch pattern now here choose sketch pattern now once you choose sketch pattern in parameters it will select the center point you will see black arrow 360 degree and check this box equal spacing and here you need to put multiple number of holes so we need six number of holes that's it keep okay now you can select fully defined calculate okay now this drawing is fully defined so you can directly choose or exit and select extruded cut now see here you can choose through all or even you can select blind just increase the cutting length okay now see the hole is created The next phase is this middle barrel and 90 minus 15, 15, 30, 60. This barrel is 60 millimeter long and the outer diameter is 50 millimeter. A sketch, normal. Now here we need to create a barrel. So let me draw one circle and a smart dimension and define this one 50 millimeter. Isometric view exit extruded boss base and this length is 60 millimeter after dividing uh subtracting 15 15 okay now this one is created let's make the front face this is the front face so the front face the outer circle is 15 15 30 30 and this length is 100 millimeter 50 millimeters okay let me choose this face a sketch normal let me draw here two lines two center lines actually now here we will create one relation choose origin point and hold shift key and select one line 
keep relation mid plane the same thing we will do for the other line line hold shift key origin point mid okay let me do one thing just connect me from here to this point this point this point and this point exit let me choose fillet 15 millimeter radius i'll select this both the end okay okay A smart dimension now we will define this distance this is 100 millimeter okay this one reduce fillet keep 30 millimeter and choose this end okay now see the circle point here uh, let me choose this circle point of this arc hold origin point coincide that's it now fillet a sketch fillet choose this end okay now see the drawing is fully defined okay circle and here we can make circle let's make two circle at this point A smart dimension let me select this one 12 millimeter okay now select both the holes and keep relation equal now see the drawing is fully defined you can just I hope you note down all the dimensions go to feature and choose extruded boss base and we want to extrude only up to 15 millimeter even you can cut this hole later next process even better to cut this hole in next process but anyway we are doing together thickness is 15 millimeter keep merge body so that it will be one body otherwise if you unmerge this one there will be a two body okay oh that's it now it's time to make some hole now first hole is 35 millimeter and that, that is 30 millimeter depth is 30 millimeter and then later the inside hole is 26 millimeter and that is throughout so this is the remaining thing so let's start to finish a sketch normal now here let me draw a circle thirty five millimeter okay now you can exit let me say isometric view then I'll go to extruded cut now depth depth is thirty millimeter inside see here okay now look now let me choose this face a sketch normal choose circle and draw one circle and this diameter is 26 millimeter now exit select extruded cut and for here we will choose throughout because we want to create a hole up to next end even you can select up to next also you will choose up to surface and choose this surface so the hole will come up to here okay now look so this is how we created a 3d model with the help of 3d sketch if you want to see suction view look in the uh, next uh, tutorial we will discuss about section view how to make different types of section view i hope you like it don't forget to share and like our video and please subscribe our channel for more video and more projects in solidworks oh that's look fine thanks for watching